Hello, this is Tim playing some more of the Telos Principle. We're going to be doing um, World C2 this time. So over here we've got another four reds of course and another star. We're using the plate a bit this time so why don't we just come up to this uh, interesting building here with a red door. And money, <laughs> money, good way straight. Rich, <laughs> money. <laughs> there you go, and of course now, um, Devolver Digital's bought Crow Team. So there you go. We'll come in here for next symmetry. So we got boxes and uh, connectors. So behind here, oh, there's our sigil locked away. See what we can do. Alright, so we've got a red door here. Can't open at the moment. Got a little buzzer here. Three buzzers actually. The red source, we've got a cube we can't get to. Here we go, got a connector. Another cube. Is that another cube? That is another cube. So what we're going to try and do, I don't think it's, it's here, what's, what's around here? Yeah. I'm going to see if we can open this one up. Now just to try something different, we're going to put it there. That'll stop that one getting in the way at least. We're in. And what's in here? Another door, ah, but another connector. We're just going to try and lock a few of these away. Now, what I'm going to try and do here, actually, hang on. put you in the corner over here somewhere. That'll do. This one's quite fun. 
hope you're not a Doctor Who fan with weep um, Weeping Angels. Right, so we're seeing a couple of boxes in there. Up here, there's our sigil pointed door, but way up there. So Rapunzel, of course, has to let down her here. We can actually climb up here. And as you can see, we're going to need two items. Now we can hop down here, of course. Let's use these. Now that gives us these crates, which we're going to need later. So I think this room is basically finished. So it's basically how do we get them up there. Next, got a plate here, and uh, this is where it gets interesting. We've got the recorder, and this. So this platform says platform can be used to have something on it. Yeah, the platform is pretty much always with the recorder. So what we're going to be doing is with the recorder, we're going to pick up the plates. We're going to walk around here. We're going to stand here, and then if you can imagine. We're going to get a box. We're going to be up here. And if you imagine that my record itself holding a plate is going to come around here, I'm going to pick up a box and I can put it on top of this plate. And then I can possibly hop on top of that. Oh, actually, you don't really need to do that. And then I'm going to come over here, my record, as you say, record, my record itself, and I can jump up. And then, uh, what's going to happen is I'm going to be up there and I'm going to grab the box. Something like that anyway. Let's see how this goes. Press record, get the plate, come around, and I can stand here and I'm going to count to five. One, two, three, four, five. That's given me a chance to put that on there. That's given me a chance to get down, to climb up the ladder. Now with the box, I'm going to jump, 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 and that should be enough to come around here and stop. Right, let's get ready. Put it on there. Is it on there? Hopefully it's working. Good. Hop up here. Come on, get closer. Come on. Thank you. Right, now I need to be back here, don't I? Is it right? Okay. Now, how am I going to do what I think? I think we're doing the same thing again. From memory. Pick up the plate, come back. Do I actually need to or not? Or is it just a case of that's recorded, left a recorder one on there, and I don't actually need to do this? I think I don't need to. Let me just check something. Because I get back here, there's a recorded one on there, so I can just take this, put this on here, and I'm done. Just like that. So we got two this way. We're going to do this one. The short wall. So we've got a recorder and that. Okay, so uh, here we go. There's our sigil. Here's our little platform. Here's the recorder. And we can hop up here. So, of course, if there's something on top of it, that's going to get knocked off. But what we can do, since this is flat... We can stand on here, hop on top of it, get taken across to either side, hop over there, go to the other side and keep going. So this is quite straightforward, and I think over here, yep. Alright. So first of all, we're going to come over here. Now I'm going to give myself a good chance. I'm going to count to five. One, two, three, four, 
five. Okay, my other shelf self should be on there. We're gonna walk over here. We're gonna stop. I'm gonna get one, two, three, four, five. That's a chance to get off. I'm gonna come around here, just pick a place and stay still. I'm gonna count one, two, three, four, five. I'm gonna come over here. I'm gonna go one, two, three, four, five, and that's enough. Let's go get ready. Hop on. You could imagine you could do this quite fast, but we just want to make sure we don't stuff up anything. Hop off. Come over here. Cool. Jump on. when you are and wait for that jump and good easy so it's very straightforward okay one more here a ditch and a fence with four, uh, four things with everything apart from the fan so we've got the recorder the platform the box and the connector now I think from this one this is a bit of a fun one with it, uh, everything uh, yeah I remember once struggling on this and then I saved a screenshot and happened to look at it later and go ah that's what I was missing so you see what the blue source there but the fence getting in the way so we can't just put it down to that that's not gonna work we need a height we do have a box but that's not gonna be enough So what we're going to be needing is, here's our platform, here's the recorder, we're going to first put this about here I think from memory, okay, so this is our box but it's going to be the other one later, we're going to get our plate, we're going to stand down in here. Now I'm going to count to 15, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Just to give myself a lot of time, then I'm going to come in and hop on the box, and then I'm going to count to, let's say 10, 1, 2, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Very good. And hopefully that's enough time. So first of all, we're going to put you on there. We're going to set you up one, two, and onto here. Great. So we've got the height of the two boxes plus the person lifting it up, it should be enough height hopefully, to get over there, and it is, and here we are, and there's a star, so let's just, your wisdom grows, but be wary of temptation. stairs here. Let's make it back here. Now, just in terms of that star, we're just going to, we don't need this anymore. We're just going to put this here for now. So, just to remind myself, hang on, what I'm doing here. I'm going to, oh, on top, isn't it? So, I'm going to get the recorder, get the plate, Stand down here and we count to five. One, two, three, four, five. Up here. And then just gonna jump a few times. Alright. So we've got a box there, we're gonna get another box. Put you on there, up on top. Just for a bit of height. 
when you're ready you can move. You're gonna hop on there, and we can jump over. Sweet, thanks for that. And around here, here's our star. So yeah, you've really got to think fourth dimensionally, I think, for the uh, recorder. But uh, just like that, that is C2 done. So next time it's going to be C3. Thanks for watching.